Hi, my name is Dr. Anna Stratus. I'm a Canadian family physician and I've been in New York for over three years. Throughout April 2020, I volunteered as an attending physician at one of the Brooklyn Hospital's hardest hit by COVID-19. My name is Lori. I am currently uninsured due to a job loss. I had the option to extend my coverage. The monthly payment was more than my car payment. Hi, my name is Sydney. I'm 26 years old and I was diagnosed with COVID-19 on April 8th, 2020. I've had symptoms since April 6th, making today day 102. I am Dr. Susan Rogers and I prescribe Medicare for all. People get so sick so quickly with COVID-19, there isn't enough time to see what insurance will cover or not, so we just had to deliver care hoping it might be covered. I'm scared that many patients I served, if they were lucky enough to survive COVID-19, may have got huge hospital bills afterward. COVID long haulers are struggling because we don't know where to turn for answers, and healthcare is attached to employment. What if I become so sick I can't work? I've seen firsthand how our fragmented bureaucracy-laden and profit-driven healthcare system has disproportionately neglected people of color and their communities. The current pandemic from COVID-19 has further exposed these glaring inequities that exist in the neighborhoods where people of color live. And I do not understand why in America we don't recognize health care for all as a simple human right. It should not be politicized. I supported Medicare for all before I got COVID and I support it now. We need to take care of Americans, but we can't do it with health care tied to employment, throwing families and individuals like myself into endless medical debt. I know there's enough money in the system to go around for everyone, but there's so many parallel systems of insurers and middlemen taking all their profits, and it takes money away from the PPE, diagnostic tests, and treatment that every American could have if only the system could be streamlined to a single payer. We need Medicare for all.